Paul, on short tracks, it's all about timing, especially if you're Thomas Schechter. This was the start of the race, came up to speed. Now it's critical. He wants to try and get as many cars as he can. He dispatches Buddy Rice. He takes care of Vitor Mira. He goes by Brian Herter. That's three cars on the track that they say you're not supposed to be able to pass. So let's make it four cars. Go by Dan Weldon as well. Well, take a look at that. Schechter with Manning just coming around the outside. Manning has been quick here. That Toyota's working for him. And Thomas Schechter's going to try and thread the needle right there through the wall. And Manning, Thomas Schechter was fastest, guys, in warm-up yesterday. Indy 225 is underway. Dario Franchini, Mark James, interestingly enough, chose to start on the outside of the front row, but boom, he takes the lead off of turn number two. Oreo Serbia was right there until they got to the start finish line. And we've got trouble. It looks like Alex Tagliati is about to oh. turn four. So the traditional, what we'd call pole position, actually belongs to. Serbia, but Dario Franchitti likes the outside line better. He will once again race into turn number one with the lead. Serbia runs second. Here comes one of the, the KB Schechter. cars, and Thomas Schechter is like a bullet on the outside. Oh, another, Mark Jensen continues, and we've got Elio. another car spinning. Dario Franchitti will bring the field back to the green flag. Oreo Serbia. Alongside him, here comes James Hinchcliffe. Hinchcliffe will run alongside Oreo Servia. And once again, it will be Dario Franchitti. Mark James with a great start, and he's already off of two. Dario Franchitti has about a three-car length advantage now. We're going to keep our eye on the back of the pack and see if everybody stays off the wall and minds their business. They do that time. We might get one lap of green here early on. Now here comes the 22 machine of Thomas Schechter. Mike, he's challenging for wow. second. Man, here comes Schechter to the inside of Oreo Servia. He will dive into turn number one. Davey Hamilton, he started 18th. He's already third. Unbelievable. You just watched Thomas, how he goes around the outside. Now, he, lo he went, tried to go to the inside, lost momentum. He's going to lose a spot to, to James Hinchcliffe. Jeff, James Hinchcliffe. But man, watch him go on the outside. Here he comes. They lift. He just keeps that outside line going. Unbelievable how fast he is on that side. He right really now. winds it up on the outside, going side by side with James Hinchcliffe. It looks like Schechter will not gain the position, Mark James. Yes, he will. So Schechter will go back to third as they come off of two. A little bit deeper in the field because Thomas Schechter is a man on the move. He started 13th, and here he is all the way up to eighth in the number two car. Let's take a look. Look on the outside. Going around the high side of the lane. He knows he can get away with that right now because the track is fresh. There's no rubber marbles up there on the track whatsoever. What a great job. And here we go on the onboard right now. Look at this. Gets blocked just a little bit. That looks like the 20 car of Ed Carpenter, that green and white car, just up ahead. Watch from going around the outside now. Takes advantage of again through turns three and four. Remember, he will not be a guy who really succeeded. Thomas Schechter picked up six positions. And if you get and if you get bravery points, Thomas always gets them all no matter where he is in the race car. And you see on the top side of the 23 car. Watch what he does here. He gets past the start finish line. He's on the outside of one and two. Everybody else gets off the gas just a little bit and he gasses it. Now the 06 he just went past was Robert Dormos. Did he say, hey, maybe I should be taking my foot off the gas and turn around and maybe try to drop a little bit too hard? But I'm certain Thomas Schechter gets the award for moving up the most position. Started in 16th and now is sitting in the ninth spot. Amazing. Starts are going to get trickier as we progress. You heard the call. We're racing again in Indianapolis. Oh, oh Dixon a... got hung out because the car in front of him was slow. He's now back in the mix and trying to defend. And there goes Franchitti. Dario gets a huge jump. Serbia looked like the car that was slow to get off the ball. And it has cost everybody but Dario. Look at that three wide through the corner. Down on the apron, this isn't going to work. Somebody's going to have to back up and take the <laughs> warm-up lane. I have never, ever seen that being done. Was that the 98 of Dan Weldon? I, I, I could not quite see the number, but it sure did look like his pace. And there he is. No, he, yeah, he's back a little bit further there, so he has dropped back a few spots. So these cars have been two abreast for the whole first lap after this restart. Second place, Dixon. Here we go down the front straightaway. Ray Hall wants the lead. Look at the slicing. Slicing through the field. And Ray Hall's going to take it. The last time that was said at this place was 1986. Through that path. Through that path. Serbia. Now, this car out there. Just hit your marks. Hit your marks. Rams radio is.
spotter telling him, hit your marks. Side by side through the corner. That is Thomas Schechter as he moves into the fourth position. Oh, oh man. I love it. Rakiti tries to get a nose in way down on the low side. He may now nah, he loses momentum. Schechter goes by on the high side. Take a look at Thomas Schechter, the yellow car. Whoa, that was on that restart. You got the momentum.